So let's look at how to configure a switch stack. This is one of the very important tasks you do as a network engineer. Say you have two switches. You want to form a stack out of these two switches. So what you do is, so you don't power those switches yet. So you put a pair of stacking cable in the back uh, and then you uh, power up those both switches at the same time. You know, it can be um, a few seconds delay between them, but uh, it doesn't matter. Um, and also, you can have uh, two running switches independently, and when you put a stacking cable, it will start to reload automatically because it will detect the stack stacking cable and the stack configuration and it will reload automatically so at the end of the reload this is how it looks like so so switch All right. so you will see if you don't set the priority manually it will be like this priority one that's the default priority and the lowest MAC address will win the master election if you see uh, here the switch one became as master because it has the lowest MAC address. But in case of you set the priority, the highest priority will win. So you always have to do uh, the priority here because that's a best practice. Say um, you added a third switch with the even lowest priority among these uh, all the switches. What will happen is when the switch stack reboot um, that will become as a master so you don't want that to happen you always uh, select switch one as the master that's one that's what is the the best um, you know practice we do all right um, so let's see how to set the priority so I'm going what I'm going to uh, do here is I'm going to uh, set uh, the switch two priority higher and see whether switch two become as a master right so it's just for an experiment so conf t uh, int um, oh, sorry switch switch uh, two um, switch two priority say uh, 14 confirm and write mem uh, and then reload confirm reload so let's see what happened um, at the end of the reboot alright so I'm going to pause this video I'm going to come back when it reboot alright So if you look at here, uh, so it's waiting on the stack master election and then see um, which switch become as a master. So we are expecting switch two uh, become as a master because we set the priority higher uh, for that switch. All right, let's see how it comes out. All right, so it should be pretty quick. All right, so and if you see okay switch to well, it's running fast go back uh, switch master election complete election complete switch to booting as master right so you saw that there uh, so I will show you you know after it's done so it's complete let's go and take a look at the switch 2 if you look at here election complete switch 2 booting as master all right so let's see enable so so switch all right. switch 2 because became as a master because it has the the highest priority so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it in a proper way. Conti uh, switch one 
priority 15 so that's how that's the highest that's how you have to do if you look at here so the highest highest number can be 15 priority 15 confirm and then I do switch to priority 14 right confirm and uh, so switch All right, now you see 15 and 14 um, if I reboot and the switch one will become as a master All right uh, right ma'am I'm not going to you know reboot and I'm going to show you because definitely this will become as a master because it has the highest priority I already show you how it works with switch 2 alright um, hope you like this video um, so please uh, like uh, press the like button and consider subscribing to my channel alright thanks